This is In Through the Outdoors, and I'm your anchor, Jason Walter, with ITTO News. Thanks to Iowa DNR brood stock with the likes of 27 and 28 inch walleyes, there are 1,889 quarts of walleye eggs currently incubating in hatcheries that will result in millions of little walleye fry, newly hatched fish. East Okaboji and Spirit Lakes will get 549 quarts. They expect to stock more than 1.1 million 2-inch walleye in Iowa lakes, rivers, and streams this summer. I was privy to evidence that some walleye on Devil's Lake are in the process of reabsorbing their eggs. Probably happens more than we know. Water temperature a couple of weeks ago was only about 48 degrees. There's also evidence that female walleye successfully spawned and males were milting. An 888-pound bluefin tuna was caught off the coast of Florida, and it broke the previous state record by 61 and a half pounds. But because it took more than one angler to reel in the behemoth tuna, it will not be considered a state record. It took six people and four hours to boat the nine-foot-long fish. Here's another one for the books. An Indiana state record perch that weighed 2 pounds 8 ounces stood for 43 years, but it was beaten by a colossal yellow that weighed 3 pounds and 2 ounces during the Mayor's Fishing Derby on Lake Michigan near Hammond. If you tuned in for a tip, here you go. If you have a Lund with Sport Track, use the Lund Quick Release Straight Sport Track Bracket upside down. They work great and they're less frustrating. On the calendar, the National Walleye Tour will fish the Mississippi at Red Wing May 23rd and 24th. That's an ITTO News update. Enjoy the weekend. I'm Chase and Walter, and that's In Through the Outdoors. You'll find more at chaseandwalter.com and on YouTube. Thanks for listening. Here's an invite to check out chaseandwalter.com for more In Through the Outdoors. You'll find episodes in print, and you can use it to buy the latest from Kuyu and Chase and Walter's microbeaded snells. And please add ITTO to your YouTube music playlist.